Welcome back everybody to Farming Simulator 22 here on Western Wilds. Your host with not the most, aka Tommy Miller, Mr. Blue. Folks, how y'all doing? Yes, I am back up here at the top of the map again. And I'm gonna do this pretty pretty fast. I hope that is not happening on the video part but the game y'all can't see it but when I turn like this I'm getting a wrinkle see what that white little circle is right there uh, right above the M bring it down here and on the video let me know in the comments if you see it if I go slow don't do it but if I go fast this right here is messing up I hope I ain't recording like that. But anyway, we're here at Miller's Sawmill. I wish it was my sawmill. Which might be my sawmill, but I don't know. Um, we might buy it, depending on how this goes. But anyway, instead of wasting time, let's go on over here. Got the sawmill, you drop your wood there, you drop your wood chips there. And I don't know what you drop there. Oh, I probably drop your logs there. Or is it here? I don't know. I can't remember. But I do remember this. I was way over here. Way over here. Looking for a gold nugget. Remember last episode? I think it was last episode. I moved this bucket. Like a fool. Messing around. Thought it was here. According to the map. I was a little wrong. I like, watched a couple of videos. That daggum gold nugget. You start right over here and it's either this grass pile or that grass pile or bush pile. Oh, wait. It's this grass or bush pile, whatever it is. You can see it says collect a bird top left. Dun dun. 50,000. Uh oh. I got something wrong. As you can see, top right, I have course play. 7.1.0.0 uh, supposed to be for grapes and uh, and uh, the olives yeah the, the, the vineyard uh, we're going to try that out in the next episode or two but folks I am sorry so sorry I am behind on your comments and stuff I've been busy um this is Tuesday morning after the 4th of July when I'm recording this, so happy 4th to y'all. And, um, yeah, I just hope everything went well and nobody got their fingers blowed off. Uh, but anyway, I'm going to go back down here. I did buy something. That's where our money was low where I go. And, um, yeah. Wouldn't that be a good thumbnail? But <laughs> it's not going to be the thumbnail. I hope not. Uh, I bought four bags of fertilizer. I bought this skid steer, a mower, and um, a high tilt bucket, uh, a bell fork thing. Uh, this here to move three point equipment around. This here to move trailers around. And of course, I bought the trailer. So let's get busy. I'll meet y'all over at the farm. All right, folks, we are back in. Or ACB here as you can see we're fixing it off the trailer and uh, got some bad news I lost a bag of fertilizer on the way here that was on the hood yeah folks we're gonna try this real quick this oh no oh no about oh. right like that yeah let's see if that works Oh, 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 we got some good grass here. We might mow this. Okay. I don't think there's a way to actually turn the droppings off. It's just a straight bush hog, so it's going to leave uh, trails like it there. So, for the time being, I'm going to park this. I really don't know where to park it. Um, 
I got this down through here is for our equipment stuff, so we're just gonna park it right here. I don't know if all our equipment be parked here, but we need a barn too, so if everything comes through, we're gonna have a good old time of getting a barn built. I don't know if we build it or not, but you know. But folks, also there's going to be a uh, a vlog coming up. Yes, you heard that right, a vlog coming up. Um, I'm not going to say when it's going to come, uh, but uh, yeah, we want we we me and the kids are taking a trip to uh, somewhere and. Yep, they're like, where? Where, where? where are you going? Where are you going? Um, I can't tell you right yet because um, I'm a true believer in posting stuff like after you, you, you do it. That way, just in case somebody can come up or won't come up and say, oh, Mr. Blue's going to, going to Florida. Let's go meet them there. No, we ain't, we ain't going to Florida, folks. It's too hot for that. But, uh, yeah. We're going to try this here. We're going to make a big old mess. Need a little bit more weight on the back of this thing, too. Get to the back. Oh, I look like I'm making a mess on the other side. Oh, this is heavy. Does it? There we go. Ease it down. Back up. Back up. Move. Oh, oh, oh. The door's turned closing. Yes, folks. This is, has automatic doors on it. Which could be a good thing. Could be a bad thing. I don't know. You can manually leave them open, but like if you're going in here trying to uh, get the sheep out and stuff and the doors automatically close behind you looky here looky here so yeah um vlogs coming it might be a couple of weeks before y'all see it but yeah but anyway uh reason why i came in here was to drop these forks right here because that's going to be off screen job getting those bells put in here I just hope I ain't doing a, a bad boo-boo by putting them in here. But the sheep are doing pretty good. Of course, they ain't been that long. But, um, yeah, let me uh, finish getting this equipment off. And I, I'm going to go get my bag uh, of uh, fertilizer. And then we're going to start fertilizing. So be right back. And I'll bring y'all back real quick. I just wanted to see if this would work. It works on that. Okay. That's right. That's how we can help move. All right, be right back. Yeah, folks, this is where I, I dropped a bag of seed at, and the farm's right down there. And, of course, you know, the marketplace and stuff's there. And I got thinking, I was fixing to put this bag of fertilizer in. I'm surprised it didn't rip. I mean, it just... It didn't rip nowhere, surprisingly. But as fixing put in, I'm like, I need to put lime down first, then fertilizer. That way, the fertilizer will kind of melt the lime, and uh, I can see where I'm going and stuff. And uh, I got curious what's on top of this mountain, so I came over here. Or, well, it's not a mountain; it's just a huge rock. But I got curious what was up here. So yeah. It's a good overlook. Look at there. Look how beautiful. Just imagine having a house on top of this. Hmm. I don't know if that's a thing or not. It'd be hard to kind of chip it off to get it level and stuff, but yeah. It's a pretty good view. I love the view of this map. You know what I love most, folks? Yeah. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Oh, no, 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 it's not that. No, 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 no. It's these little secret spaces. Yeah. Turn around so I can go down it right. 
Oh, oh yeah. Mr. Blue. Oh, oh, almost slipped. Oh, I'm getting too big and fat, or too fat and old for that. But anyway, um, yeah, I went down this way. I'm like, hmm. I don't see nothing. Not even carvings on the wall. So, a little bit of of uh, algae growing here or wherever that stuff green stuff is on the wall that grows but I come back down here past the ladder I'm like what's down this way hmm I, 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 I love being in caves folks I really do so I'm gonna duck so I don't hit my head and I'm like oh water it's, it's not that that deep it don't look as deep as it looks I should say and then I got looking around and I got looking around like, I don't know if that's a marking or not, but I don't know, it kind of looked like a grapple hand or something. But anyway, look what was laying here. <laughs> Gold, folks. By the way, it's another 50,000, and, and before I even change it secretly, I'm going to tell you I got the time turned down so I can get some things done in this day because I want to plant canola today, but it's... A lot of stuff I gotta do before I plant it. So I turn the time down. And then I uh, uh, put the course play in. And now y'all can't see the stuff when it pops up. So, I'm gonna meet y'all at the market. I'm gonna turn the air back on for a few minutes. Cause it's getting stuffy in here. And uh, we're gonna go get a bag of lime and I'm gonna take course play out. Temporary. So I'll figure out how to move that. So yeah, be right back even though I'm around the corner. All right, folks, uh, by building sawmill north of 20,000. I don't know if it's price going to be north of 20,000. <laughs> anyway, no, it's uh, the north sawmill building. We're going to buy it for 20,000. And uh, been purchased. Okay, now we now own this thing. And it's still got uh, planks. It's 21, we're missing wood. We gotta get some wood down here, which I knew that. Um, but anyway, yeah, we bought this. We gotta start making planks, folks, and start making money. But anyway, I come down here, and I was talking to this guy about putting lime in here, and then he says, this thing ain't supported with lime. Ooh, I did not knock that bag off. But anyway, um, going our own vehicles here, uh, what we own and uh, you can see right here it only takes uh, fertilizer and that is right here so we're going to go pick up that bag of uh, fertilizer I dropped get busy alright here we go putting the fertilizer in I don't think that's going to be enough to do that one feel but we're going to start over here by our ground first, I guess, so. And that way I can get the GPS set up and everything. Oh, left mile an hour. But we got a big whiff here. I'm going to stop right there. I'm going to go uh, Alt-C and then control s and we're going to go to here go to there just click it so it'll be registered all the width it's a whoo whoo what's that whoa okay yeah um see i'll be really overlapping i'm gonna try to just get that blue line over there from the grass as you can see it's about right there it's kind of hard to see all this up there. See right there, blue line. And um, pull forward a little bit, get locked on. I got my lock on to my reverse, folks. So anytime I'm doing GPS, all I gotta do is hold my left B. Well, I get connected first, see? You just hit reverse, it's gonna do like, hold your left bumper and then back up and it won't take it away. There's a little, you know, whatever it's called for y'all. little info. Yeah, that's going down pretty fast. 
Oh man. Oh. Oh, I just I messed up, folks. I should have took soil samples first. I totally forgot about that. <sighs> All right, we'll we'll do this field like this, and then I want to, next episode we'll have soil samples. I, I'm sorry about that, y'all. Yeah, Mr. Blue messed up. See, I just hit my reverse button to lock on. That's where I got it set up, and then I can just hold a uh, left bumper and back up and it won't take that line away and then you know, turn on my fertilizer rig it's done pretty good um but yeah let me finish this field i'm gonna put another bag in i know it's just yeah if i don't run out before i get up here i'm pretty sure it's going to take all three bags to do the rest of this field and the other field so yeah i'll bring you back when i get to the uh whatever i'm doing be right back all right i got that one field fertilized and i just want to come down here uh before i do time and course play and all that well i need to get the course place off all right i was playing the simple in this case y'all want to know and what I'm talking about up and up or right up there where we got our money, hundred and sixty six thousand and sixteen dollars. You go know, start. Go down to um, this is our map. Go to course play here and show info text window. You want to deactivate that and let's see, I can't do the background blur. Okay. But anyway, here is active. I go out. Oh, no, it's not showing. Okay. Well, anyway. You you want to show info. What is? What did I deactivate? Oh, I deactivated that. No wonder it didn't show. This one right here. Show info text window. Active. And you go there and you see course play is up there telling you all the jobs and stuff that's going to be done. You go in here and you deactivate show info text window go back out and it's gone folks okay now as you can see we got these four up here we got these three right here so that's seven and these two here is eight and nine and we go into one of these windows yeah one up oh, right here Collectibles, we got nine of 20. And I can't get my mouse scroll over, but the, over to the right side, the bottom of that list, collectibles collected, nine of 20. So, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine. That gives us, uh, we're gonna try to find this one right here. Um, below 13 and above what, 23? We're going to find that one. And I'm going to show y'all the secret to get this one up here. And I'll show you what I'm talking about here in just a minute. But I'm going to go to here. And uh, yeah. Uh, 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 it, let me look one more time. Oh. One more time. It's bottom of 13 and above 23. That should be. Okay. We'll go to our tractor here. And we're pointing south. Bottom of 13. Try to stay on this line as much as possible. It's going to be another one of those that's in the bush. Alright, here we are. Um, nope, need to go this way. Could it be this bush? No, nope, it, it, it definitely psyched me out because I thought that was uh, it. Well, let's put our F1 back on. And uh, that way it'll help when we walk over it. Uh, it showed it in a bush. So it might be over. Actually, it's back over it this way. Could it be in this big bush here? 
Right there it is, folks. Right there. And you can see it says collect up there. And you see where I'm at. It's not quite on the to the, the lines there. It's a little bit off. More in field 23. So collect. Now you can see our stuff up there. 50,000 for a collectible. All right. Now we're going to find our truck. Detach this trailer. Start this up. And we're going to go on the other side of the map. And then we'll come back to farming a little bit. Eastbound and down, keep those truckers a rolling. <clears throat> yeah, folks. Didn't know this truck could go this fast. And the mirrors even works on it. But we're moving into, get it right here, the very top right corner. Very top right corner up here, folks. There's a tent. Yeah, I'm gonna stop right here. There's no way over this wall here. There's an invisible wall barrier that keeps you from going outside the map. Cutting the signpost will, with a chainsaw will permanently remove nothing from this map. Get a little smiley face right there. It removes nothing, so don't even try attempt cutting it. There's a very secret way of getting it. That go nugget right there. No, no, no. Even uh, Xbox users that don't have scripts can get this nugget. It's so simple. Stupid simple. You just get in your truck. And then you, you're going to get up here. And then you're going to back up in the bush. You're going to let your tailgate down though. No, just kidding. You're not going to let your tailgate down. You're going to basically scrape the paint off the side of your truck here. That's the only thing to it. You just scrape the paint off the side of your truck. And voila, you're on this side of that barrier. Anything over here? We, ooh, a bag of money. Wouldn't that be something that was like a bag of money we could actually get? But anyway, here's our 10th uh, golden nugget. Another 50,000. Collectibles, 11 that we done got. We got, what, nine more to go. Nine more to go, folks. Y'all want to get them all in this episode? Now, the trick is, oh, man, I'm, I'm trapped on this side of this burial, burial here, this visible wall. I can't get back out. Well, actually, you can tab to another vehicle, or you can just get next to your truck and hit X. Scrape the paint off and go to the next one. Um, which I don't really know where the next one's at. I kind of do, but I don't. I kind of do, but I don't. I'm going gonna, I'm gonna to make my way down to that blue dot that's in um, 38, I guess, in the woods. Yeah. Oh, I'm almost there. Oh, I got across the river. We're going to have some fun today, folks. Yeah. We're going to have a little fun. Do 70-something mile an hour through the woods without hitting a tree or a ditch. Oh, oh. Oh, oh. Which way was I going? Don't do that in real life, kids. That hurts. Speaking of real life, you know, we've been having some accidents left and right, folks. Y'all need to slow down out there. All right, um, oh, there it is, right over there, and there's a gold nugget here somewhere, I don't know, oh, right there, plain and simple, Mr. Jim, you just, because I, I was thinking about going up and it'd be at the top until I saw the video. And if I remember when I'm editing this, I'll put the two videos that I watched in. But yeah, he went up and up and up and up and up and up and looked and looked and looked. He's on his way down and he just happened, came over and saw this and he's like, oh man, that's so simple. Folks, we're up $316,000.
who needs a farm right now? Let's just uh, continue with the gold nuggets and uh, go on my paradise trip. Anyway, that that right there. Um, we're going to go over to the town. Let's see if I can get my way out of here without hitting a tree or a ditch again. All right, ditch is almost right here somewhere. Oh, there it is. We're going to go over here first. Um, I forgot to maximize my OBS, so it's kind of small. I'm just looking. we got about four minutes or so. We're going to try to finish finding some of these. Um, like I hit a wall barrier. I always thought it'd be a gold nugget and, and like one of these, but that that's uh, that's too simple. Um, let's see if I can find a way in here. Um, no, I can't find a way in. All right, but we're gonna go back to our. Um, oh, by the way, uh, I got 34%, which is 1,108 liters. And I got this whole field here fertilized. Uh, we're going to skip lime because, uh, you know, it's it's one of those things. Um, but I do have a load of logs to sell. So I'm going to go, I'm going to detach a spreader right up here. And uh, I'm going to go sell these logs. Looks like I still got one to load on there. Mm, I thought I was done with that. But anyway, I'm going to get this to the sawmill, sell them, and I'm going to go look at that map and see what we can find again, folks. Be right back. All right, this might be a little lengthy video. I don't know, but as you can see, all the green dots we already got, and we're going to try to get these three here. And we got, we got three, six, seven, eight left. So let's do it. Oh, first off, we're down here at the sawmill that I bought and uh, I figured out what's what. This is probably where the pallets going to spawn for the planks and that's where you dump them because it's got the dump symbol and this here is where you uh, take them away. So you can see now if you're over here wood planks is running um, wood is 17,291 liters out of a thousand and planks we have two liters out of 25,000 so they'll spawn right here and yeah um, we gotta go get a uh, dig up tension belts you can hear them all the time anyway we gotta go get some uh gold nuggets let's get back to the truck all right as you've seen uh, I just popped up down here at the BGA so I go to the big map you can see I'm rotating over there on the right side of the map oh but can't do that too much it gets easy but you come down here and you, you know you come in this way and you're like you got the way station here and you come on down here. I think everybody knows about this and already. Open the gates. And uh, Mr. Jim, why do we have to wait who to get to that? Well, it's like that one but that was in the water. You have to have like a ramp to get to it because if you just dunk down, go out there, you won't be able to get it. You have to be kind of on top of it to collect it. A lot of people tries to jump on those things. I see one guy uh, brought a belt system up here and made an L shape, took a tractor and lifted it up over here and set it down and was able to get it that way. That one's gonna be last because uh, when I get that one, we're going to end the episode. Anyway, we come over here, put your earplugs on. Um, and the set of stairs here which that might go to, but I don't think so. Oh, wait, it, 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 I took you to the right one. It's that stairs that you don't want to take. 
go nuggets right here. Collect. Uh, 50,000 bring us to 366. Uh, when you come across here, uh, stairs. Ooh, look at the fire. That's pretty. That uh, set of stairs brings you to right here. It, it don't go very to nothing. All right, there's that. What happens if we turn this off? Ooh, belly bell. Hey, hey, you might get mad at me. All right, we're gonna walk, run, whatever, down to this end. If you hear noise in the background, it's my daughter rattling the sack to get the dog treat. Anyway, here we go. Here is the next one. Another 50,000 added. And yeah, and just, I watch videos, folks. I'm sorry. If I was looking for that, it'd probably take me all year. But anyway, that one's right down there, over into that thing. Around all the way back down here, we're going to close this gate back because it was closed when we got here. I didn't feel like jumping over because I'm too fat. Anyway, now to our last, last nugget. We're going to try this. Um, yeah, I'm going to try to run, jump, and get on that and there as it's passing. Alright, here we go. Oh, oh, I found the pool. I found the pool, folks. Now, oh, yeah, be good. Close them back and give you room to get up the stairs there. All right. Man. I'm stuck on the wall. But, yeah, this is a good show, y'all. Oh, wait, did I get the clock sign? Oh, that's, I'll try right here. No, no collect sign as you can see. It is, it, it's like it tries to get up, but it, it just won't let you. All right, try this again. You gotta hold your speed button down and you make this jump. Crap. Okay, maybe I can't get um my thought I saw something right there. Chris is picking up the pole. Well anyway, yeah, you got to have See, even here you can't jump out. You, it's just the right height where you can't. So I'm gonna try this again. Jump, oh. Okay, that's too fast. I don't, I, I don't know, folks. I did know one way of getting it. You can get it. Uh, Xbox people can get it. You just have to use your imagination. If you know how to jump on those, you can get it pretty fast. Yeah. Um, but I'm going to go to flight mode. I I'm cheating, folks. Sorry. Go to flight mode. Go over. And, uh, come on. There. Come on right there. Come down. Collect. 50,000. Now I gotta go, um, oh yeah, I can go under now. I thought, uh, this one guy, I guess he's done it before, he dropped a, uh, a ladder off in here. I guess it's why it was showing down there. But anyway, yeah. Let's yeah, close those back. I'm gonna... Call it the episode, folks. Uh, well, maybe. Let's see here. We got 15. We got five more to go. Let's uh, get back into the golden nugget. Uh, thing. Hang on. I got to do this real quick. Turn flight mode off. 
There we go. Fall down. Uh, people smell me right now. They're going to be like, ugh. Anyway, all the top ones, this one way up here. Uh, these four, this one, these three, these two, that one is done. We could probably probably could go down here real fast, get these, or get that. So let me get my truck and I'll be right back. Alright folks, I looked up and down, up and down. I even went up there. And I'm like, I'm, I'm right here at field 55 north of it, which is this tire. I looked around the legs, all the way around. And I got up there and I started looking down. I guess I need to show y'all, but I was on the platform and I was looking down on this side here and it sparkled from up there. Yeah, so it's not right on the tire at all. It's over over here. So, another 50,000. Folks, we're getting rich off of gold. And by the way, I think I just saw a comment. I was in YouTube just like, real short matter of fact i need to go uh refresh that so i can make sure i'll do that while i'm gonna get back in the truck and go to the next one so be right back one down to the saw south sawmill all right folks we made it down here to south sawmill and right off the back i'm like you see smoke just boiling out of this chimney you see some boards laying here I don't know what's on the back side. It, you know, it kind of spoiled it for me. I guess you can jump here and, and try to jump there and go up that way. But you see these boards here? I don't know if it's like it's on Xbox or PlayStation, but you just kind of run and jump up and you're right up here. And here's a gold nugget. Another 50,000 folks. Woohoo! Now you're like, where to go now? Well. All these logs look like they're hiding something, right? Well, kind of. Maybe it's in the shed. You can look for days and days and days, but Mr. Jim, he, he's very creative. Very creative. And uh, he put this in above us this time, folks. He put it up here on the rafter. I would never have thought to look there. All right, you can just kind of stand under it and then collect it. Another 50,000, woohoo! Okay, now, all right, we had one here and one here, and I'll try to pull up bottom map. They're kind of like all pinned together, but this last one's gonna be really, really, really tricky. As you can see, any other time, you could run through these any other time you can't run through these X's yeah here we can we can go around to the gas station okay well in Am Creek I think it was uh, well yep I can grab it okay the guy did try to use a ladder but he couldn't get it to work so this is the guy that I watch he used uh a telehandler and I uh, see here just kind of run and jump up on M Creek I believe it was right in here on the gas station somewhere but it's not on this and it's up higher higher and higher oh um okay but the ladder won't reach I might reach if I can do it right. I'm going to see if I can do it different than the other guy did. Because that ladder is laying right here for some reason. And, and, can I get it to do it? <gasps> I did! I was wondering why that board was there. The ladder was like, like right here laying. And you got this little board right here like it's nailed down. And no folks, nobody told me about this. And I just kind of guessed. Because I figured this ladder, the guy was having a hard time trying to get the ladder go from up there to the ground. And uh, I'm like, I bet this ladder will go from here to there. Yeah, 
Look at here, folks. Watch me be wrong. I saw the video where the guy found a gold nugget up here. Uh, I, I bet you I am wrong. I bet you it's... Oh, oh no, 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 no. Look at here. $50,000 again. Who needs to work their butt off farming all the time, right? Well, we're going to put this lighter back. Yeah, I tell you do, folks. You just kind of... Well, you be on the other side, but just just kind of get it where it'll fall. Ooh, that is barely on the edge. A lot of times the ladders are slide, so when you get on this side, you want to just kind of make sure you bring your ladder, like to right there against that board, and lay it down, and it's perfectly fine. Perfectly fine. And you can grab his ladder from the ground too. So. Now, I don't know if Xbox can grab things or not. If y'all can grab things like this, let me know. Um, I don't know exactly. I, I don't play Farm Sim on Xbox. It's PC only. But anyway, we're going to go to our hut now. And we need to hurry and get back to farming because we got to plant canola. But we'll, oh, I will hit the picnic table. But I'm going to come to this hut here. And as you can see, if I can get situated here, all across the top, we got four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten, eleven, twelve, thirteen, fourteen, fifteen, sixteen, seventeen, eighteen, nineteen. 14, 15, 16, 17, 18, 19. There's one left. One left, folks. Y'all want to try it? Should be about a 45 minute video all together. So I'll be right back. All right, folks, I had to come down here real quick to look at this last one. It's It's been bothering me like crazy. Let me get back to the truck. Um, well, let's get in the truck so you can see a little bit better. All right, all down that side and all down that side. I got the truck as close to the fence as I could. Like we did that one, you know, this sign. If you cut this sign, it would do absolutely nothing. Yeah, well, I, 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 I even like scraped the paint off my truck again, trying to get to this. That don't work, folks, because it's not there. I'll shut this off so y'all can hear me. Best way I can tell you is look at this building. See where it has one, two, three, four lines right there. And then over here, it's got two lines, like rust or something, running off the building. Best thing I can say is get back here where you're in the grass instead of the bush. Get your cursor lined up. It's about right there. And just walk gently forward. And keep walking, keep walking. Until you see something that says collect. So you're right here. And if you look down, wait, what? I don't see nothing. Why do I not see this? Because, folks, this one is hidden. If you just look down and around, you don't see it. You have to kind of spread these bushes out like this, kind of walk through there like that, and right there it is. It's right there. But the best way I can tell you, Oop, see, I got to turn around myself. Is just line your cursor up with this. And when you ease forward, you look down, right there he is. Collect. Collectible. Congratulations, 20 nuggets found. Uh, whatever that is, 20 nuggets. Uh, oh, it's probably in a different language. So you found all the gold nuggets. Of course, I spent some money. I didn't keep up with how much it comes to and stuff like that so y'all gonna have to figure that out 50,000 times 20 All right did the math y'all add it up put it down in the comments and folks we are almost millionaire almost but anyway we have the sawmill now I'm gonna put the time back to regular and how I do that is somewhere in here Okay, there we go. Time is back. Um, 
folks, I want to buy some things now. Uh, we're on September 1st, and we'll go in here. We can still, it's going all the same, but I'm going to talk real fast. We can still plant canola first thing in the morning. Because we got two days on September. The weather showing September 2nd some rain. Do we take the gamble? Because I really like to get those rocks out of that field. I need to take soil samples. There's a lot of things I need to do that we haven't done yet, you know. And uh, I kind of like to fast forward time because I don't know if it's going to show it here, but you know, we got auction on a piece of land. And I like to see if we can win that auction or how it goes. I kind of figure out it's probably over by the BGA land to buy it. I'm not for sure. Don't hold it to me. Uh, I do have some more logs to cut down here on the far end. Um, yeah. Um, let me go drop these off. What I've been doing is I should have gave a little bit more room around the sheep area here so we can bring trailers in and park them kind of like the flat bell there we can just bring them in and about right there disconnect oh no I want to leave that and connected I want to disconnect that I'm gonna go ahead and shut this off for right now because I'm fixing to end the episode uh, but I want to come over here and check our bales 11% because I have been um, I was picking up the animal sheep barn 65 I'm too close Get on this side and this is 10% so yeah these was glass and this was the first batch down here 11% so basically this field's fertilized I want to go and here while I'm thinking about it I don't know where it's at I think it's under miscellaneous and we go over and over bunch of stuff in here folks bunch of mods I got um, I right hear we need these two pieces of equipment I don't know if that actually does the soil sampling or it's afterwards a lot of people are saying there's a change in that so we're going to get the soil sample and we're going to go ahead and buy it it's no customizations to it and stuff so we're just going to buy it okay and uh, back out this other thing um, yeah it, it's part of it 10 winkle FGV 600 what is that a weight added to it look like it's on a weight Hmm. I guess that's what we can set it on and keep it from. Now it would be good if we. Uh, that's a 1500 weight there. 2500 and back. We might get it with a weight. There's supposed to be also things you can put on your tractor too. So we'll wait about this till we get some more info, info from some of y'all. Um, I don't know if it's all tractors or what, but yeah. Um, I like to get a bigger planter. I really, really do. Uh, let's go up to, I want to get a stone picker too. I can't remember when to pick stones. After we plow? The cultivating, is that going to mess it up? Now I really don't know. Let's go in cedars. I like to get a bigger cedar than that one. We're going to go all the way over here. Not that big yet. I'm looking at these John Deere ones right here. I think it's... Uh, we have Great Plains. And then we have three John Deere ones. This bad boy here is what we had on our farm growing up. Yeah, it's pretty nice. We planted soybeans with it. I think we can plant canola too. 
Um, yeah, um, uh, all the other things. That says nine one. That's four five. And that's a little beady thing. I don't know. We probably go with this in here. We'll do that all in the next episode. Give me more time to think about it. But folks, I gotta get off here because this is a this is a fifty three minute video. Good God Almighty. Okay. The next video we're gonna be doing some soil sampling and, and stuff like that. We'll try to maybe change this fertilized uh, spreader that we got down there over to something that will spread the lime too. And uh, we'll get some lime spread on this and fertilizing lime on the other field. We'll get, I think we can only do uh, soybeans, which is too late. We can plant canola in there. The only thing about planting canola, we're not going to have enough uh, time before harvest because, yeah, you got to plant them earlier. But we might get a couple more fields before then, so. Yeah, um, I'm going to go ahead and plant canola in it. I think I'm going to plant a little bit of wheat because uh, I'm going to get some chickens. And then uh, we'll put all the rest of it be canola. Um, but yeah, this section from here to there is going to be grass that we can uh, fertilize and everything like that. So, folks. Till next time, y'all have a great day, a blessed day, and I will see you next episode. Oh, I, I supposed to say that last. Uh, I want to say I love y'all. Thanks for the comments, and uh, thanks for understanding that uh, you know some of my comments are like four or five days late now. Um, I will get to them, folks. So uh, keep hanging in there. I love each and every one of y'all. I will see y'all later. Bye.